Welcome! This tutorial will guide you through the process of setting up an account in Secure Access Washington, known by the acronym SAW. Let's start here on the PDC website. When you file most reports through the website, you will be redirected to sign in through Secure Access Washington. You can get to SAW through the PDC filing system, or you can go directly to SAW by searching secureaccess.wa.gov. SAW helps to protect your information, your PDC information and other information that's stored behind the state's firewall. Most state agencies use SAW for access to their services, and the PDC is updating all of its online services to use SAW. If you have an existing account, you can log in with that. You do not need to create a special SAW account for PDC access. If you don't have a SAW account, you'll need to create one. Now your screen may look a little different depending on the size of your device, but notice the Get Help button. You can use this if you're not sure if you already have a SAW account or if you don't remember your username or password. Here you can also find information on a few other topics. To create a new account, use the Sign Up button and enter your personal information. You may want to use the same email address that you use for your PDC filing, but on that note, do remember that an email address used to file with the PDC does become part of the public record. You will need to create a SAW username and password and will want to store that in a secure location. Click I'm not a robot and then click create my account. Once you've submitted your request, you'll receive an email with a link to click to activate your account. The email will come from secureaccess at cts.wa.gov. Once you've clicked the link to activate, log into your account. If you're not already connected to the PDC, you'll want to use the Add a New Service button. Click the button, click Browse a List of Services by Agency, scroll down to find the Public Disclosure Commission, click Apply, click OK, and you will now find the PDC electronic filing system connected to your SAW account. Let's go back to the PDC website. Depending on your filing history and whether your PDC and SAW email addresses are the same, when you file a report you may be taken straight to the SAW login like this. On the other hand, if you are accessing a particular function that hasn't completely transitioned to single sign-on through SAW, you may be prompted to link your PDC and SAW accounts. If you see something like this screen that prompts you to activate single sign-on, simply follow the instructions. From that point forward, you will automatically log in through SAW, and will be able to access all of your PDC filings. In fact, once you are in your PDC dashboard like this, you can even bookmark this page for your future use. The bookmark would not require you to set up single sign-on again, but do remember to securely save your SAW password for those times you do need it to access the PDC. Feel free to reach out to the PDC if you have any questions and have a nice day.